Laws of Exponent. I am Anil Kumar and now let us conclude this playlist with a tricky multiple choice question. Question is, select the correct answer for 3 cube minus 3 square. We are given four choices. Now reason for my placing this question right at the end is that we have done too much of power rule, quotient rule, product rule. Now in this case, you need to check whether those rule apply or not and then write down your answer. You can pause the video, select your answer and then look into my suggestion. 3 cube minus 3 square is equal to 3 to the power of 5, 3 to the power of 6, 3 or 2 times 3 square. Well, let's work it out. It is take away, right? It is not product or quotient. So none of the laws of exponents will be applied here. Right? Treat it as a simple question. So it's a simple question 3 cube minus 3 square. That is it. 3 cube is 3 times 3 times 3 like this, right? Minus 3 square is 3 times 3, which is 27 minus 9, right? Which is number 18. This is one way of doing it. The other way is we have 3 cube minus 3 square. We could take 3 square common, right? So we have 3 square common. We are left with 3. Right? There are 3 threes, right? So when I say 3 square common, that means 2 threes, right? Common. And we are left with 1 3 here, minus 1. So that gives us 3 squared times 3 minus 1 is 2, right? So 2 times 3 square, which is also 18, right? It has to be the same thing, right? So that is the correct choice. Option D, okay? So that is the correct choice. So let's conclude by saying that whenever you are applying the laws of exponent, be careful that you have to have same base with product or quotient, not with addition or subtraction. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope you enjoyed this journey with me. Thank you and all the best.